Hello, this is Rakesh Rao from Design Sense Software Technologies, Bangalore, the sales and support point for BricsCAD in India. In this BricsCAD support video, I'm going to show you how you can create dimensions with different sizes and how you can control the unit scaling in the dimension length. Now, in this drawing, you can see that there are four lines, each of a length of two, and we are now going to create dimensions for this drawing. So first let's go to the dimension style under drawing explorer. You can see this is my current style and these are all the settings for my current style. So these settings can be controlled here or they are also available through system variables where you can directly control them. So for example the setting that I am currently interested in is this one which is called dim scale overall. This is controlled by the dim scale system variable and controls the overall size of the dimension. So by overall size, I mean the text as well as the arrow size and so on. So let us come here back to the command line and I'll just type dim scale and you can see that currently the value is one. So let us create a dim dimension with the dim scale value as one. So this is how it looks when dim scale value is one. Now I'm going to type dim scale and change the value to two and create the dimension again with two. So this is dim scale two. So once again, we go change the value of dim scale to three and create the dimension here and dim scale value to four and create the dimension. So you can see now that for the same line, which is two units in length I have created four di different dimensions with dim scale values changed as 1 2 3 and 4 so the dimension is identical except that the notations the arrow size the text size etc get scaled up based on the dim scale value so this is how dim scale value affects the size of your dimensions now the next thing that I want to show you is a command called update by which you can change the dim scale after the dimension has been created. For example, in this case, you can see we have four dimensions with four different dim scale values. So I'm now going to change the dim scale value to one and I'm going to start the dim command and I'm going to click on update, which is here. You can see the highlighted characters UP or you can even type UP on the command line. So I'm going to select all these dimensions and you can see that all of them have now got updated with the dim scale value of one. So let me undo and back to this one now. The next thing that I want to show you is how you can change the scaling for the dimension unit. Now the dimension unit is two in all these cases, but what if I wanted this particular line to be shown with double the length instead of two, I wanted it to be shown with a dimension of four. Now that's pretty easy as well in BricsCAD. Just click on the dimension right click properties scroll down so dim scale overall this is the one which i showed you just now but dim scale linear this is the one that i want to show you now so instead of one i now make it two so when i make it two the value of two gets multiplied by two and you get four instead of two so this is how you can show a dimension of a given length with a different linear unit value so you can scale it up or down based on a factor here so this could be useful when you want to let us say show a feet dimension in meter or a meter dimension in centimeter and so on so you can apply a suitable dimension linear unit factor and, and it will appear in the required converted units as you like it now there is a point to note here when you change the dimension linear unit for a particular dimension you often want it to affect only that dimension and not all the others. Now, if you do a dim update like you did earlier, it is going to apply the dimension style parameters to all the dimensions. And in that process, the linear units also will get changed once again. So to prevent that, we have created a command called du. So when you use the du command, which is a dimension update command, it will update the dimension scale value for the dimensions but will not alter the dimension linear unit value that you have changed say for example i'm going to now change dim scale value to three and then i'm going to show you both the options now the regular option in BricsCAD is dim update and i'm going to select all of this so when i did this you can see that all the dimensions got scaled with a dim scale value of three 
but in that process my converted dimension 4 again reverted back to 2 so this is not what I want I wanted the linear units to remain as it is as I changed it I wanted only the size to change so let's see how to do that so once again I go do an undo revert back to the original position and then now I'm going to run the command called du. Du is a cat power enabled command which enables you to update the dimensions and it will change the dim scale of all the dimension but it will ensure that any customized unit change that you have done in the dimension is retained. So now I use du command and you can see that my dimensions have scaled up as per my dim scale but my dimension unit is again retained. What I changed to 4 is now retained as 4 and has not gone back to 2. So this is how you can use the du command in cat power to update your dimensions and yet retain the linear unit factor change that you may have applied. Thank you for watching this video and do let me know if you have any questions.